Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of MEW or Matt Six Year Wrestling, where today I have for you a brand new review, and yes, the figure's already out of the box, I already had the review done, I was gonna get ready to edit it, and then I go to edit it, and my file for it is corrupted, and I guess that is the downside of switching to a new camera in the middle of basically getting reviews out the door say that i'm sorry that i don't get to show an in the box shot of the figure because i already had the figure out of the box and i figured this would just be the best way for everybody just to kind of get through the accessories get through the figure get through the comparisons final thoughts and opinions so that is what we're going to do today is we're going to go over the aew supreme collection walmart exclusive cm punk this is a figure that i think everybody wants for a few reasons a it's CM Punk. B, this is the closest thing to an Ultimate Edition we're going to have till they start making CM Punk figures again from Mattel. And three, he's in WWE. Everybody's going to want this figure for their, you know, prediction videos, their reviews, everything like that. They're going to want the CM Punk. I absolutely love CM Punk. He's one of my go-to guys. He's one of my personal favorites in all of wrestling. So, since CM Punk is out of the box, how we're going to do this, sorry that that intro was so long in explaining everything, I do apologize, but how we're going to do this is we're going to go over the accessories for CM Punk, then CM Punk himself, and then we're going to compare him, and then we're going to get into my final thoughts and opinions on the figure, and yeah, basically that. So, let's dive into CM Punk's accessories. All right, guys, so diving into CM Punk's accessories, as you guys can see, he does come with a lot of accessories. Now... I will say that CM Punk does come with some really nice hands out of the gate. He comes with another fisted hand and a mic holding hand. Really, really nice out of the... Really, really nice. These are good. Really, really nice. The interchangeable legs fell. We'll get, we'll get into the additional attire here in a few moments. But he also does come with the, you know, go to sleep signature pose hands. These are very, very nice. Love these a lot. You got the nice sculpted on hand tape on there. It does say drug free with the X on there. Really, really nice. And CM Punk comes with these really, really cool, like hang loose hands with the drug free on them. These are really cool. CM Punk does come with one of these on the figure when you pull them out of the packaging. And he does come with the other mic holding hand as well as the fisted hand. He does come with this mic holding hand out of the packaging. This fisted hand is just another. Um, accessory with his hands really, really nice so it does say drug free on there the sculpting on there is absolutely awesome really really cool let's dive into the interchangeable head sculpts the first one out of the gate is going to be this like i don't know what you want to call this this like raised one like kind of like a snarling head sculpt if that makes sense you got the cm punk black um slicked back here you got the ear behind the ear tattoo really nice like this head sculpt it's a very nice head sculpt a very interesting head sculpt he also does come with the unmatched series 4 head sculpt or the walmart exclusive head sculpt this is a pretty good head sculpt you know got us by you can definitely you can definitely tell that it was painted a bit darker because when we get into the comparisons actually i'll pull the figure over here this is a lighter head sculpt well this head sculpt is different but it's basically the same thing and he also did come with another head sculpt that was basically this head sculpt but you can see they darkened everything to make it more accurate to cm punk this is more brown in my opinion, and this looks better. I like the black, I don't like the light uh, blondish brown. But really nice head sculpt. And for the other interchangeable head sculpt, he comes with this yelling, like mid-match, you know, hair getting into the face CM Punk head sculpt, or as I like to call it, the Blood and Guts exclusive head sculpt that came with that, just with no blood and the hair is a little bit different. Really, really nice. Beard looks good. Open facial expression looks good. Absolutely love this. He also does come with an a AEW World Championship. Really, really nice. We got so many of these now, we could probably make his championship that he had before he left, before he got fired from AEW. But nice championship. It does clasp in the back really nicely. Really, really nice. like that a lot. Um, For the uh, cloth goods, he does come with the best in the world. Cut off, sleeveless shirt. Really, really nice. Does Velcro in the back. Very nice. Like this shirt. Does say AEW on the bottom. And the best accessory, he comes with this CM Punk best in the world hoodie really nice as the fake pockets on there the cuffs on the sleeves the hood this is an awesome accessory i love that a lot and for the gear he does come with his camo gear really nice you know some really good articulation with this as well really really nice 
I wish it would have continued on to the boots and the kick pads and everything like that. I wish it would have did that, but it doesn't. It's just plain black. I felt, I feel like they should have did that, but it's not the end of the world. But anyways, guys, that is going to wrap things up for CM Punk's accessories. So let's dive into CM Punk himself. All right, guys, and diving into CM Punk himself, we're going to start out with that absolutely amazing head sculpt that he's got on right there. And this is a very nice head sculpt. Very, very nice. Looks just like CM Punk. You got the hair coming off. This is like mid-match. Nice smiling head sculpt. The hair slicked back a little bit with the beautiful fade back there. It does have the behind-the-ear tattoo. Very, very nice. Going down into the, the chest and everything like that, he's got his really amazing tattoo work on the front. Really, really nice. Going down into the sleeves, he's got his Pepsi-Cola tattoo right there he's got his other tattoo right here that are a little bit missing because for copyright reasons but hopefully mattel does the same thing that aew and jazzwares did they just get rid of a little bit of the coloring because on his mattel figures that they used to do this is missing this tattoo and this tattoo are missing so it just left the shoulders kind of blank i hope mattel and wwe can do that but he's got all his great tattoo detailing you can see his deck of cards on there Really, really nice. You got the spider web back there. All the beautiful tattoo work. Even got his little fish skeleton on his shoulder. More tattoos right here. But he does have the butterfly joints. He can do the full 360 with his arms. His arms can move up. He does have the bicep articulation. Double jointed pinless arms. And he does have sculpted on wrist tape, which is really, really nice. He does have a very good ab crunch. He has the diaphragm movement. He can move side to side, which is very nice. He's got his tattoo across his stomach. He can't do a full 360 down here by his waist. Going down into the attire, this is the better attire of the two. I love the black, white, and silver, or the black, white, and gold. Absolutely love this gear. This is a very nice gear. He can kick forward very nicely. He can do the splitsies very nicely. He does have the upper thigh cut. Double jointed pinless knees. Actually, are they pinless? Oh yeah, they are pinless. Check that out. They are pinless. That is good. He's got black knee pads. My upper boot rotation has always been stuck with this figure, and I can't figure out why. But he does have the gold and white on the kick pads and the boots. Very, very nice. Like these a lot. This is what I wish they would have did on his other attire. I wish they would have did that. But it's not the end of the world. But I'll just, I'll just use this attire because I love this one the best. He does have the toe pivot right there. Very, very nice. And he does have a ankle rocker as well as a pivot. But guys... Oh, and he does have the X's on hands. I already went over that. And the tattoos as well. Just kind of wanted to recover that again uh, for you guys. But guys, that is going to wrap things up for the AEW Walmart exclusive Supreme CM Punk figure himself. A really good figure, but let's dive into some CM Punk figure comparisons. And diving into the CM Punk figure comparisons... Oh man, we are comparing him to some really good CM Punks. These are all AEW CM Punks. I don't have any Mattel CM Punks. But it's just awesome to have CM Punk in my collection. We got the Walmart exclusive CM Punk right here. I'm still missing the unmatched series number 4 CM Punk. I think I might order that CM Punk while I'm ordering the Ring of Honor CM Punk. Because I do want to get that CM Punk because that is the last AEW CM Punk that they're making. And I kind of would like to have every single AEW CM Punk that they've made because I think it'd be cool to then do that comparison when Mattel starts making his figures again. But this is just awesome. You have the Walmart exclusive right here. You have the Blood and Guts exclusive two-pack with MJF CM Punk right here. This is probably the best CM Punk. And what I want to see is, is I want to take this CM Punk and put it over here on this attire. And I want to see how that looks. So we're going to check that out really quick because I really want to see that. And there is the Blood and Guts 2-pack CM Punk on the on the Walmart exclusive one. And actually, I got one more comparison I want to do. So let me fix this CM Punk and let's get into that comparison. All right, and the last comparison that I want to make to CM Punk is the Ringside exclusive um First Dance CM Punk. I actually forgot to put this figure up here. So this is what this CM Punk looks like with all the CM Punks that I have in my collection. I love all of them. I really want to get the Unmatched Series 4 as well as the Luminaries Collection Ring of Honor CM Punk. I think I want to get those CM Punks as well to add to this collection. So that way we can kind of compare all the CM Punks and then we can compare them all when we get our first Mattel figure again. But yeah, that's going to wrap things up for CM Punk. So again, really awesome. Absolutely love this.
Love this a lot. All right, guys, now that's going to wrap things up for the review today on the AEW Unrivaled Supreme Collection Walmart exclusive CM Punk. This figure is awesome. This figure is absolutely awesome with all the accessories it comes with, everything like this. If you are a CM Punk fan or you just want CM Punk in your collection or you want him in your pick fed or whatever, this is the punk to go after. This is, without a doubt, the best CM Punk released yet. This is definitely the best one they've ever released. I absolutely love this CM Punk. And yeah, I think this CM Punk definitely needed to be made. And I'm so happy they released this figure because this is a 10 out of 10 figure. I absolutely love this. But yeah, not a lot to complain about. Just the stuck um, upper boot rotation for my gold and white gear. Um, hopefully your guys' doesn't have that. But I just really want to get this. I, I really want to fix that, so maybe I can find a way to fix that. But, yeah, that's going to wrap things up for the review today. If you guys did enjoy, consider leaving a like and a comment down below, and consider subscribing to the channel with turning on the notification bell so that way you guys never miss an upload here on the channel. Go follow my Instagram. If you guys would like to pick up this figure for yourself, this is a Walmart-exclusive figure. And if your guys' Walmart is anything like mine, they have had, like, ten of these at once. So this figure should be pretty easy to obtain, but I'd recommend picking this figure up. I, I'd pick it up. This is a 10 out of 10. But yeah, this figure is an absolute 10 out of 10. But yeah, that's my final thoughts and opinions. I'm going to get out of here. I'll see you guys in the very next review. Have a great day or night wherever you are in the world. And peace!